Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's having a great day today. So today's video is another episode of Glossy Box Unboxing. Look at that box though, it's so pretty. Like this in itself could be a piece of art. And it's textured. Sorry. If you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Elizabeth, and I do a lot of unboxing videos, makeup videos, boxy charm spoiler videos, and no, this is not my normal setup. I where I normally film the building that I had turned into like my filming studio, we had to completely rip the ceiling out and take care of an issue, and so the entire place tore apart, and I can't film in there. So in the meantime, I'm filming in my car. We're gonna do a vlog style and just go with the flow because some things you can control, some things you can't, and that's just one of those things I can't control at the moment. So yeah, if you're interested in glossy box, make sure to keep on watching this video, of course. And I appreciate if you take a quick second, hit that subscribe button to become part of the Wolf Pack today. Now let's get into it. Alright, so along with me filming in my car, let me just tell you guys, the last video that I filmed in here, I had Mia, our big dog, she's back here behind me, she was in the house, and you know, she was so upset that I was filming, or I was in the car and she wasn't with me, she barked the entire time, so I had to bring her in here with me, okay, and she got so excited, and now she's panting very loudly, um, hopefully she'll calm down here in a second, but if it continues, I apologize. <laughs> I won't do this again, but I just felt so guilty. I wanted to bring her in here with us to hang out. I actually have two dogs in here, but the other one is so quiet you never notice. Like, you won't hear her. But yeah, here is the box. And this thing is so pretty. I honestly, like, it's it's almost like a 3D effect. I love this box. But the theme this month is Let the Sun Shine. And with the box this month, they included a gift card. This is for Velvet Wear, Velvet Eyewear, and you can get $25 with code PEACE21. So if anyone wants to go shopping, feel free to use that code. And we have our little booklet telling you everything that is in the box. Now this, they did tell me in advance that my items aren't going to match exactly what's in the booklet. So I'm not sure how that actually works out. Um, one of the items that I didn't get, so I guess that's the variation. I was kind of disappointed because <laughs> I really wanted that other item, but you know what, I, it's okay, it's okay. We got good stuff in the box this month. And also, by the way, before I get into this, if you're interested in signing up for Glossy Box, I'll have all the information linked down below in the description box, as well as a link to where you can get your first box for $1. So yeah, make sure you check that out if you, if you want to get some more subscription boxes. So I'm not going to go in any particular order, just going to go for it. So the first thing that we have is a thermal water, and this is from a brand called Uri, Uri Age? Uri Age? I'm, I'm, no, I'm butchering that. And this is actually the bonus item in the box this month. These type of sprays, especially this size, is something that I tend to keep in my bag pretty much 24-7. Anytime I want to add a little bit of hydration to my skin or if, I don't know, if I want to irritate Devin, <laughs> I use these because he hates it whenever I spray him with stuff, but it's just water, so it's not going to hurt him. I just, it's just one of those things he just, I don't know. I'm, we're weird. All right, so the next item that we have is from Evita. Now, this is a brand I have heard of before, and I've actually got several different hair care products from them, but this is the Nutriplenish Leave-In Conditioner. I don't think I've tried anything from this line before. Mia! I'm sorry. She's so loud, guys. I do, I really apologize for this. She's not burning up. She just got too excited to get to go for a ride, basically. Um, but this is good for all hair tops. And leaving conditioners is something that I keep in my bag, like my gym bag. Whenever like I have a bunch of these size leaving conditioners, they say this is full size. I do not agree, <laughs> but that's okay. I'll definitely get use out of it. And plus, I don't think a full size one would actually fit in the box. So it would have to be this size. And I'm just curious to see how this smells. Some of them smell really good and like a, a fresh scent. Or some of them can smell like a bunch of chemicals. So as long as it doesn't smell like the chemical kind, I'm fine. That smells floral. Mmm. That smells really good. So this will actually shield your hair from UV rays and heat damage. Oh, that's really good. Something, so it's combination product. Um, this is 98% naturally derived free from silicones, parabens, and sulfate cleansers. It protects against the drying effects of the sun, leaving your hair nourished all day long. So you can mist it onto clean, damp hair. Ooh, or you can use it on dry. You can use it as a detangler. Okay, this is really good. This is a multi-purpose product. This is definitely something I would want to buy the full size of. My hair, 
needs all the help it can get it's a little bit dry right now but I'm not gonna try and do my hair while I'm in the car like there's not really a lot of room for that so I'll hold off on using it but it's definitely gonna get used okay now this is the item that they said that wasn't gonna match what was in the booklet and um, this is from Bella Pierre the stay put brow gel and this kind of reminds me of the one from Bene Benefit it was uh what is it Cabral the one that's in the little pot um, but I've already got makeup on and I don't really want to use another brow product but yeah you got the little cap there and that stuff that's the right shade for me that's that's a perfect match and then the brush is in the cap just like the one from benefit yeah so it's compact I like products like that um, as long as this doesn't dry out too quickly I know the one from benefit it dried out much quicker than what I thought it would I don't know if that's for everybody maybe I didn't close it tight enough but hopefully it doesn't dry out that fast Okay, here's a product that I've actually gotten in another box. I can't remember if it was in Glossy Box previously or if it was in a Look Fantastic because they're, they're a sister company. Um, this is from Nep. Kep? I, I don't know how to pronounce this, um, but it's a mineral bath salts and it's got essential oils and it's vegan. I don't have a bath, I have a shower, so I actually can't use this. So I'm gonna pass this along to someone else who can use it, probably my mom, because she's got one of those big old garden tubs. I think she would really enjoy this, but let's read more about the product. After a busy day, there's nothing better than a pampering bath. These stress relieving salts promote better sleep. Oh, better sleep, that's cool. I did not know that, oh, dream away. Oh, that makes total sense now. I had no idea. Oh, and it says that this is on lookfantastic.com. Okay, so I got it in a Look Fantastic box. Okay, so I saved my two favorite products for last in this video. Um, this one is from Nails Inc. Now this, like, have you seen Ink Credible, like the glosses and stuff that I talked about in a previous BoxyCharm box? They have nail polishes, and I kid you not, these are the best nail polishes. The formula is good, it's very chip resistant, it lasts a long time, but the biggest thing that I enjoy about it, besides obvious colors, because the colors are really pretty, but it's the brush. The brush is one that is shaped in a way it makes it so easy, almost foolproof to do your nails. We got a nail polish in Glossy Box last month. It was um, NCLA, I think was the name of it. I love the formula on those, but the brush drives me crazy. This one is good. It's a thick brush, but the way it's shaped, it fits perfectly against your cuticle without the little sharp edges. Like, you can control it a lot easier. So, I'm so excited for this. I'm not the craziest about the color because it's a little bit bubblegum to me, but I'm going to try it out. My, I've got a nude polish on right now, and I messed up on it because it was one that didn't have that brush. <laughs> so I'm so glad that this one, I only have like two from this company, so I'm glad to have another one. But I'll try this one out and see how it looks on my skin tone, because it may end up looking really, really pretty. What it looks like in the jar may be completely different when you wear it. This wasn't in the booklet. I'm sad. So, yeah. So I had two items that weren't actually in the box. Hmm. So I can't tell you what the retail value of either of those are right offhand. But, okay, the best item in the box, I just discovered this brand through BoxyCharm, and I really like their skincare. This is from Earth Harbor. This is the Helio... Let me open it. Earth Harbor. This is the Helios... Helios, however you say it. The Anti-Pollution Youth Ampule. This is made with red algae and plant stem cells. The last one, I used it um, for the first time in a video, and it was the... The green one, I can't remember the name of it offhand, but it made my face incredibly red. Even though I did a patch test, it took a while for my skin to calm down after I used it, but it didn't make me break out or anything. I have very reactive skin, so I'm going to use this one for the first time off camera and see how it does so I can kind of get a feeling for it. But I'll definitely have to do a patch test on this, um, but I'm so excited for this. And for some reason, the colors of their products, like this one is red, the other one was green, they have one that's yellow. I love that they're different colors. I just really, I don't know, I just love the packaging, like, even though this isn't part of the packaging, or is it? Is it just a red bottle and that's it? That might be what it is. But anyway, either way, I'm happy with it. I really enjoy the way they did this. The packaging is very sleek and it's a glass bottle. And let me tell you a little bit about this because it was on the booklet. And this retails for $48. Oh my gosh. Almost 50 bucks for this thing. So this box is a really good deal just for this one product alone. Oh, and by the way, make sure if you're interested in signing up for this, go as soon as possible because they've already emailed me. This box is selling out fast. Like it's almost gone, if not already. So check it out as soon as possible. All right, but anyways, let's talk about the product. Unparalleled in strength for combating pollutants and daily skin stressors. 
I say these words really funny. This ampoule is a necessity for skin in need of after sun replenishment, bold defense against elements, and thriving barrier function. It restores antioxidants, normalizes skin pH, and smooths fine lines. Yes, yes, yes. All that sounds really, really good. And by the way, again, a little another, another side note. <laughs> If you are a Glossy Box subscriber, make sure you're going on there and doing reviews for your products. Fill out the surveys. That way you can get points and get free stuff from them. So yeah, that is everything that came in this box. But now let's talk about the products that I didn't get in my box, but that were listed in the booklet. First one is this item right here. This is the one I really wanted. It's from Josephine Cosmetics. It's a Do You the Flawless Liquid Highlighter. I really like... I have a ton of highlighters. I know I do, but what's one more? I was really hoping to get that one, and it retails for $36. The other item is from Polar. This is a very high protection sun cream with SPF 50, and this one was going to be a deluxe mini size. But SPF 50, that's really good. I struggled to find a really good sunscreen, so I would have been okay with that. But yeah, guys, that is everything that I got in my glossy box this month. I think they did really good this month. I really enjoyed it. Everything from products and even to the design of the box is so pretty. I tell you, I'm half tempted to cut this after I'm done using it as a box and just make this like a little display piece. Like, it's so pretty. I know it's not about the box, it's about the products, but still, I can appreciate a real pretty box. <laughs> But yeah, thank you so much for taking time to hang out. I really do appreciate it. If you're interested in the makeup look that I did today, I actually filmed to get ready with me and all the products and how I did everything will be in that video. If it's not live yet, it will be soon. So make sure you have uh, notifications turned on so you'll be notified when it goes live. And yeah, thank you guys. Um, I'm glad Mia kind of calmed down. She got quiet there for a minute. She's like, I don't know what she's doing. She's sniffing at something in the floorboard. I, I don't know. She's a weird dog. But yeah, I love you guys. Have a great day, great night, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!